everyone, it's Gina here from OrchidandOpal.com and today I'm back with another unboxing, this time for the April 2022 dollar bead box and bag monthly subscription. I'll leave the link right down below the video to take you right to that subscription. It'll have all the details that you need to know. And I do have a coupon code as well. It is ORCHID2 that will save you $2 off any purchase, whether that is a subscription or a membership or a purchase from their bead shop. If you subscribe to this box, you may not have received it yet. The delivery date is different for everyone and really corresponds to the date that you signed up for your subscription. But let's go ahead and open this one up. And we have our dollar bead bag on top. This is an additional $8 a month add-on and inside you get every month four three millimeter fire polish bead strands and four four millimeter fire polish bead strands. This is a great way to sample all different colors and finishes and it's a fun surprise to see which ones come in the mail each month. So before we get into the box contents, let's go ahead and look through the bag. And as you can see on the insert, it says dollar bead bag subscribers can reorder these items through May 2022. And that goes along with all their items at dollarbeadbox.com. If you are a subscriber or a member, that gives you access to shop their store. And you can get some really great prices on products like the fire polish strands, picking them up for just a dollar a piece. So the first strand we have here in our three millimeter section is the Alabaster White Electric Purple. And I just love this strand. I find that there haven't been as many variations in the purple strands for whatever reason. There's a lot in the amethyst shade and more pinky purples, but this one is a very vibrant and solid, more bluish purple that is quite beautiful. Next is the classic crystal. You can't go wrong with having a crystal clear strand. These will go with anything, of course. No additional finish on this or anything, just the crystal clear faceted glass. And another strand I haven't seen before is the jet half metallic purple. So this is black and it's got that vibrant purple that matches the first strand. It's just a little bit more metallic, but those two will certainly go really well together. The entire base of the bead is jet black and then it's got spots where you can see that purple showing up. And then our last three millimeter strand is this one. It's called amethyst and it's a very, very pale amethyst. So you can see it doesn't have a whole lot of pigment to it, but put up to the crystal clear, you can definitely tell the difference. It's a light pinky purple. So those strands actually go pretty well together and they aren't really meant to when you get these dollar bead bags and boxes. There isn't a specific theme and things don't necessarily match according to a certain color palette. You can think of these as more of a sampler, things that you will be able to find on their website if you wanna pick up additional items. Let's go ahead and look at our four millimeter strands. First up, we have the Crystal Pink Lumi, which is this one. It's crystal clear in the background. It's got this dusting of light pink over the glass and still lets a lot of the light through. Then we have the gold copper or vitriol gold. And I'm gonna say mine is the vitriol gold. You can see a lot of that gold on these beads and then that vitriol gives us those pops of different colors showing up in parts of the beads in still a metallic sort of a way. Some of the pops of pink and purple and orange green that you can see in certain areas. Next up, we have another Lumi strand. This is the Crystal Tangerine Lumi. So a very citrusy looking light orange coating over the crystal clear that's in the background that looks very similar to the pink we saw at first. And then here's a look at our fourth four millimeter strand. This is the Matte Peridot or Matte Olive some people could receive. So I received the Matte Peridot. You can see that frosty green glass in that juicy sort of green apple color. I'm actually really loving like the green, that peachy orange and the pink together in particular this month. 
So that's all for the April 2022 dollar bead bag. So a dollar per strand, a great deal to get all different sorts of fire polish strands that are very versatile, working with bead weaving, stringing projects, and lots of other beading crafts in very usable three and four millimeter sizes. And then we'll bring back our box. You can see there's an insert at the top. So we'll take a peek at that. All right, and I thought I saw them email something about this. It sounds like they were able to move to a new facility, which is always a lot of work, but very exciting. So it's talking a little bit about that. It also has their social media and contact information listed there at the bottom. And then on the back, we see the list of everything that's included. So at the top, we have our strands of beads. And then there are going to be additional items. Again, think of this as a sampler of things you can find on their website. Let's take a little peek in the box. All right, so here's what it looks like upon first moving that tissue paper. And I'm gonna get organized with all of these items and we'll go down the list of contents to take a close-up look at everything one at a time. All right, starting with the top of our list, we're gonna look at the strands first, and this is the one that comes up on top, which is a string of six by eight millimeter check glass oval beads, and you could either receive dark zircon, which is this one, or olive green, and there's 17 pieces on the strand. I love that rich saturated capri blue color. And then next is a strand of olive green check glass pearls. These are a six millimeter round size and there's 20 pieces on this strand. I've been really happy with the check pearls that they have been sending. We've gotten a chance to sample a lot of different colors and different sizes. They have a beautiful sheen or luster on them and I find that they are very decent quality to work with. Up next, we have a very basic strand of crystal glass druck beads or rounds. These are a three millimeter size, so very tiny, some of our smallest beads for this month. And just like we saw in that fire polish strand with the crystal, of course, you can't go wrong with having some of those because they will go with everything pretty much. Up next is another fire polish strand, this time in a five millimeter size and the color is called beige travertine. There's 25 pieces on this string and you can see that travertine finish giving us those variations in the color, making these look a little bit stone-like. And it's quite often that we'll see a size five, six, maybe even eight millimeter fire polish strand show up in the strand section. And it looks like we've got another one to follow up with this. And that is a five millimeter size check fire polish strand in the turquoise half bronze luster, 25 pieces on this one as well. And of course, it's got the opaque turquoise, kind of greenish turquoise glass in the background. And then you have the partial metallic bronze showing up on parts of the beads. Another nice addition is this strand of six by 11 millimeter check glass leaves. And the color is called olive with copper. So you see the copper metallic that settles into the veining of the leaves to give us those details. And that is some transparent olive green glass. It's letting some of that light through and also giving us that bit of greenish color. Our last strand in this section is a string of three by five millimeter check glass pinch beads in olive and there's 35 pieces included. This is a sort of lighter olive green. That pinch bead has a rounded three-sided shape, and this is a generous size strand. It looks like we got a lot of olive green this month. So seven strands in that section. Again, you can go on dollarbeadbox.com if you are a subscriber or member and pick up any of these items for just a dollar a piece. So that's one of the big draws of the subscription is being able to do that. And in the next section, we've got some bagged items and it's really a random assortment of all different things, including beads and findings and even some buttons. Sometimes you'll find additional focals and other metal components, chains, stringing materials, etc. And those are all things you'll also find in their shop. And we start out with our first bag, which is containing the 12 by 15 millimeter check glass table cut anchor beads. And these are in the color blue opal with travertine. As you can see, there's two pieces included. So 
So here are these two tabular anchor beads. They're like a table cut with that blue glass that has a little bit of striation going through it and the pressed anchor shape that's on the front and the back. You get some of that travertine finish around the sides and also settling into the anchor and then the hole that runs up and down through the length of the bead. Up next, we have a bag containing the 12 millimeter check glass two hole pyramids in jet blue AB and there's three pieces inside. You can see how they are a jet black in the background that AB over the top of that black gives us the vibrant blue and purple and sort of golden metallic shine that we see. And these are a very dimensional bead. They've got two holes that run parallel through the flat base and then they have that pointed top. Our third bag contains the 18 millimeter check glass origami flower beads in Peridot AB and we have two of those. And here's a look at that shape close up. I really like these. I like the sort of minimalistic geometric flower design that they have. I've gotten these in another color before. We have the frosty kind of peridot colored glass and then the AB finish giving us a slightly shinier metallic that settles into that pressed glass shape and the hole that runs up and down through the length of the bead. Next, we have some of the transparent green check glass leaves. These are a six by 11 millimeter size and there's 12 pieces in the bag. So here we go. These are a little bit more of a teal green or a forest green and they have that hole that runs through the top. No additional finish or wash on these leaves. You do get some of that detail though that you can see is pressed into the glass and they are the same on both the front and the back. Bringing in some findings, we have a bag of brass ear wires. These are in the antique copper plating and there's four pairs inside. So these are some very simple ear wires and just an example of some of the findings that you can pick up at dollarbeadbox.com. In addition to this bag containing some four millimeter jump rings in antique brass, there's 20 pieces inside of this bag. So these jump rings are in a yet another metallic finish and you can't go wrong having some additional staples like that to add to your bead stash. Something that we've been seeing recently are some Tiercast branded products, and this is a B button that is from that company. It's in antique silver plating, and it's a 15 millimeter size. Here's a closer look. You can see how this has a lot of detail going on. There is a look at the back. It would make a very nice clasp, and Tiercast products are always great quality to work with. Next up, we have two spiral pewter charms. These are a 10 millimeter size. And there's a close up look at these. These are something that are a little bit rougher, not quite the quality of Tierra Cast, but still usable. And right away, it makes me think of using these along with some of the larger focal beads that we've seen, maybe make a quick pair of earrings using these to drop off of the bottom. Getting back into some more interesting check glass shapes, we have three of these cats. They're gray with gold wash, 11 by 17 millimeters in size. And there we go. And they have a different front and a back as well. I have one flip to the back so you can see the difference there in the two sides. And of course, like it says, we have that grayish glass in the background, it's opaque, and then the golden wash that settles into the details on these cats. Here's a look at the hole placement. It does run up and down through the bead shape. We then have some eight by eight millimeter check glass flat stars in opaque white AB and it says there's six pieces. So we have these four pointed stars and the AB coating is extremely subtle, but if I move these slightly under the light, you can kind of see them on top of that more matte opaque white glass, just giving us a hint of iridescence 
They're pretty flat and appear to be the same on both sides, and then they have the hole that runs through the center. And our last bag is containing some 7mm Czech glass turbines in opaque gray and teal combination. There's six of those included. So here's that fluted shape, those turbine beads hole running through the center, and you can see how the teal is combined with that grayish glass to give us a variation in color, not just a flat opaque shade, but some of that teal showing up in different spots along with the gray. So that is everything for this month's dollar bead box and bag subscription. Again, it's a monthly subscription. The bag is an add-on that is an additional $8 and it's optional. This one actually is a little bit more color coordinated than I'm used to seeing, but typically there isn't a specific color scheme or theme. So it's a great box to pick up if you are looking for a sampler of things you can find on their site or simply want access to be able to shop their site and pick up so many different things for just a dollar a piece. The subscription runs around the $18 to $20 a month price point for the box itself. And if you sign up for a longer period of time, you do get the shipping included. So the price goes down a little bit on a per box basis. But again, I'll leave the link to the subscription right down below the video so you can check out all the details for yourself. And I'll leave the coupon code below as well, which is ORCID2. And again, you can use that on any purchase. So even if you are an existing subscription, Subscriber, you can use that on any purchase at their store if you're planning to go back and pick up any additional items. Well, that's all I have for today. I really appreciate you all being with me. It makes it a lot more fun for me to share these contents with you. And if this video is helpful and or enjoyable, feel free to give the video a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe while you're here. Share the video with your other bead-loving friends and feel free to leave a comment down below letting me know what you think of the dollar bead box or this month in particular or anything else you'd like to say. I'll be back again real soon. Until next time, I hope you all have a fabulous rest of your day and as always, happy beading. Happy beading.